It was tougher than tough. It was rougher than rough. Blood, 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 blood and fire. A tiny Caribbean ghetto in West Kingston, Jamaica, Trenchtown was most prominently known as a garbage dump before the government decided to build housing on the land. It was the beginning of the 60s and the penniless rude boys and Rastafarians that populated these government yards spent most of their time sitting around and waiting for the pressure to drop. Many began performing and listening to a music that was both a mixture of Jamaican Minto and U.S. rhythm and blues. It was called Scat. In Trenchtown and the shanty town surrounding it, the flamboyant dance hall DJs were mixing in ska music at their nightly jump ups. These sound system dances attracted local teams and also provided a proving ground for the neighborhood gangs of rude boys who were constantly flicking their ratchets, step and razor. In a society that not only denied their identity, but also their existence, the rude boys would emulate scenes from their favorite movie, which starred a young rising Caribbean actor, Sidney Poitier. The groups would use the concrete drainage gullies that crisscrossed the city to rehearse in. And on most weekends, a talent contest was held and provided a forum where the young ska artists got to display their natural talent in front of a live audience. was not being played on the government-controlled radio station RJR. To actually hear it, you had to go to the jump-ups. And the competition for the Trenchtown dance crowd began heating up among the DJs and their sound systems. The Jamaican police force was always nearby to quash, clash, and jail the rude boys on a nightly basis. They were taking out their hidden political agenda on the Blackheart Man as well, or more widely known as the Rastafarian. In Kingston 12, as Trenchtown was also known, it was getting easier to hear ska, although it remained difficult to record due to the limited number of musicians, producers, instruments, and abundance of upstart ska recording groups. Regardless, ska continued to grow, and record producers even had pressing plants right on the premises, manufacturing the acetate recording disc within hours of laying down the two-track recording for a minimal cost and at maximum profit. The United Kingdom was the first country outside of Jamaica to embrace ska and soon afforded international hit status to Millie Small's ska song, My Boy Lollipop. Ska had now changed over to a rock steady sound and groups rose to the occasion. Rock Steady was short-lived before the introduction of reggae came about in 1968 and attracted even more of an international following. It wasn't until the early 70s that this music was finally given the chance and a reggae album was first recorded and finally heard in the United States. Among the built-in obstacles and the oppressive antagonistic conflicts of man and his environment, coupled with the constant struggle and suffering commonly found in stories portraying triumphs of the human spirit, Life in this tropical ghetto provides a perfect dramatic backdrop. No boy got no fear. I still Hello, I'm Bruce Wayne Gillis, the indie filmmaker behind the major motion picture of Brute Boy. And you're invited to come along on a revolutionary path and spiritual journey and perhaps pledge your support to the making of Rude Boy along the way. Rude Boy is a powerful story about the terrible tragedy of growing up in Trenchtown, Jamaica in the 60s. Winston Brown is Rude Boy, an oppressed ghetto youth who pioneers ska music into rocksteady and then into reggae. It's a story that's never been told, never been heard, it's never been seen. Until now. 
For the last 20 years, I've made over 50 films for a lot of different people. This time, I'm making my movie for you. This is a dream project. I'm on here and out here, seeking your support to bring maximum respect to reggae music. Please consider pledging and take advantage of some of the nice one-of-a-kind rewards we have for you. Thank you very much. Listen to me As I try Fire make it burn, if a blood make it run. <laughs>